It's just a routine procedure, Cassie, an oral swab taken from the inside of your cheek. We'd like you to accompany us to the station to do that now. What if I don't want to? We have a warrant from the court, so legally we can compel you. What does that mean? If you refuse to supply a DNA sample, then you can be arrested and charged with obstruction of justice. I'd prefer not to do it that way, but I will if I have to. We need to identify this baby. Honey, this test is just to prove that the baby they found isn't Knox. That's right. This test could rule you out as the mother. We need that information urgently so we can get justice for this child. You do want that, don't you? Cassie? I think that you're a good person and you do want to help us. Or do I have to place you under arrest? I don't think that'll be necessary, Detective. We'll cooperate, won't we? Right, let's get it over with. It, does it have to be at the station? It's a simple procedure. One that could be done at Shortland Street, somewhere, you know, less intense for Cassie? That's fine. Follow me, please. I'm coming with you. Okay. should be free. Hey, Pete, can we have the room for a minute? Sure. Right, I, I can do the test if you like. Someone independent would be a lot better. Um, okay, um, Pete, would you mind finding a nurse just for a quick oral swab? Okay. Hey, it's all right. It is not our little boy. And this test will eliminate you. But what if it doesn't? I'm sure that it will. What are the chances, though, a baby in the same park? It might happen, Cassie. Okay, so we just have to stay calm and see. But if it proves Knox is dead? We'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Hi, Pauline. Uh, we just need a cheek swab for a DNA sample. No problem. Uh, how long will the results take? 24 hours, according to the lab here. They're not making any promises, though. It could be the day after. Open wide, please. Done. Okay, well, if that is all correct. I can take it down to the lab for you. I don't think that's a good idea. I'm on my way down now. I can do it. Um, great. Yeah, thank you. Please. No worries. Thanks for your cooperation, Cassie. I know this is hard for you. Do you need me to do anything else? Not at this stage. We'll be in touch to let you know the result. No, I'm going to bed. Okay. Good night. Night. Okay. Gallop me. Shout. Just get it out of your system. You really think that'll make me feel any better? What's better than you shutting me out? Oh, for God's sake, Nicole, this isn't about you. Well, it's not about you either. I did what I could in a crap situation to help Cassie. Oh, with a police ambush? Re-traumatizing well, her? I'm, I'm sorry. She just can't keep running away, and I think that you know that. I was lying to the police for both of you, and that had to stop. You know what really hurts? I mean, not just that you tricked me. What? You didn't trust me enough to do the right thing. who love each other. One of us is a funny way of showing up. It was an impossible situation. And I'm the emotional liability who can't be trusted. Yeah, I got those headlines, thanks. I do trust you, Maeve. I trust you with my life. But if I told you everything up front, would you seriously have come straight home? I know that it's scary to face the truth for Cassie, for all of us, but we have to. Because if that baby who died is Knox, we need to know. And the hours are gonna drag on today, waiting for that result, and I don't wanna be fighting with you. So can you, can you forgive me, please? Oh, 
for me. Oh, Nick, I'm terrified. Because you can't unknow things and then you just, you can't keep hoping. Well, we can keep on hoping for as long as we can. And, you know, if the test doesn't match, we'll keep knocking for knocks until we find him. down to room nine, please. Hey, you guys, how are you feeling, Madonna? I'm no pain, so that's good. Post-op check up with Esther. She's running a bit behind, sorry. That's okay. I mean, I'm a bit nervous, to be honest. I mean, what if there are complications? I mean, fertility can be so fragile. I will take it as it comes. Good attitude. Yeah, it's hard to not be anxious when you're waiting for tests and results. I hate you. Maybe we should wait in the cafeteria. Well, the cafe has come to you. Just how you like them. Oh, thank you, sis. Look, I know you've probably got butterflies, but relax, okay? You'll be fine. Um, Selena, any chance that you could cover for Marsha and ED? What? No. Sure. Okay. You've got this, sis. I wish I could just reach into my head and drag the memories out. They'll come back one day. Will they? What if I'm blocking something terrible? That's what everyone thinks. Honey, Knox is out there somewhere, okay? We will find him. We'll never give up, Cassie. I'll get it. <laughs> Baby, come in. Um, do you have the DNA result? Yes. What is it? negative, right? I'm afraid not. What? I'm sorry, I really am. Cassie Lloyd, I'm arresting you for the infanticide and unlawful burial of your newborn son. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There must be a mistake. Cassie's sample was a perfect parental match. The baby we found is definitely your grandson. 